Rob, police told us here at police headquarters just a little while ago they have now arrested and charged a 16 year old boy with first degree murder for the death of that seven year old boy. But interestingly, police say they are still investigating this case and there are two other adults who are also in custody but not yet charged. Seven-year-old Akeem Briscoe was simply washing his hands in his family's Humboldt Park bathroom days before Halloween. Which should be one of the most safest places uh, your child should be. Just outside in the alley, investigators now say a 16-year-old boy was part of a group gunfight. There was a group that was in the alley behind the, the residence where the seven-year-old, as the suit mentioned, was just washing his hands, and a separate group approached from the alley they were targeting this group that was in a car in the alley. Investigators say one of those bullets pierced the window and killed the seven-year-old boy right there in front of the sink. A 16-year-old who police did not identify is now charged with the young boy's murder. His family, still reeling from another death in the family, begged the gunman to come forward. If you got a soul or something inside your body, turn yourself in, man. He was loved by a lot of people. Investigators reached out to the family with word of the arrest, hoping it brings some comfort to a family stunned by gun violence that shattered the safety of their own home. I spoke to the mother of that seven year old boy just a few minutes ago over the phone. She says she's still not ready to publicly discuss her seven year old boy's death, but she said she still feels no peace even with these arrests. She said she won't feel anything better until she knows that everybody who's responsible for her young son's murder is brought to justice.